Okay, hi guys. So I guess this is like kind of like a follow up to my Mercari haul. This is going to be my binder organization. I got a uh, well, organization, let's be real. Like it's not very organized and I kind of have like two binders. So we'll try and figure stuff out. Um, I asked for some questions, some Q&A questions, and people were like so sweet. So I have like a lot of questions to answer and I really appreciate that. Um, if I forget to answer questions or, like, I just stop answering questions, it's just, just know that because this is very overwhelming. Like, taking out everything and putting it here, I'm feeling overwhelmed. Um, <laughs> it's a lot. Uh, another thing to know is that my organization is to be not organized. <laughs> so anyone who asks for tips, I'll give tips as much as I can. But I also have some, uh, friends and some other youtubers or collectors that I'll link below that give actually like amazing tips because me <laughs> it's a struggle um yeah and I also decorated my binder <laughs> for you guys um I think I'm gonna get some like fan art or something to put in here because usually I just leave it blank and I kind of just took one of my red bubble stickers and put it there and I thought it was pretty but it's not straight and it's not nice like just chill in there so yeah that's the first thing that my binder is it looks like that so um this is like a basic flip through there's a lot but also there's a lack of oh my god i'm just realizing i'm starting to lack space in this this is like a three inch is this a three inch no it's a two inch um see now i <laughs> It's over here. I'm going to take it out so that it doesn't get bent or anything. I'll expose myself. My binder actually just looks like this, aka boring. Um, and there's photo cards falling out. So as you can see, this is going to be another chaotic mess. That's my brand. Um, I also have this binder, which actually does have a Jimin fan art. Oh, I don't know the... I bought it at like an event. She was kind of just selling it in the streets. Um, so I mostly keep photos and bigger things in here. So I might be putting more stuff in here, which I have space for. So there's that. I keep some of my um, magazines in here as well. I have a few other magazines, so I think I'm going to maybe put them in here if there's any space. And then I have a final binder, which also has a BTS magazine. Does it show that I really like BTS magazines? I didn't even get the Esquire one. We'll see if I end up finding it. Um, and this is just for my um, pocket things. So, so yeah, let's get started. First things first, actually, I got some pin mail. I opened it already, but I was like, I also want to open it on camera. So I'm fucking obsessed with this. It has my birthday on it. Because spring day came out on my birthday. Or the teaser came out on my birthday. That's why I ordered it. It's absolutely stunting. Let me see. I want to take out all the freebies first. Okay, so. This is absolutely adorable. Thank you for supporting my work by buying a pin from me. I hope that you... Uh, the pin and freebies have stolen your heart. Absolutely, Julia. And it's, I don't know how to pronounce that, Bretuka pins? Bretuka pins? I'll link them down below. Um, yeah, this is absolutely adorable. Cute little freebies. All spring day because y'all know spring day is my queen. Well, I mean, it's the fandom's queen, but she's also one of my favorite songs. Um, so here's the pin. I know, I know, she's gorgeous. It was in a pre-order and just looking at it, whoa, that went flying. She looks absolutely stunning. First of all, the packaging is adorable. I freaking love bees. Okay. I want a needle felt a bee. Okay. So here you go, more up close. I know, I know. So, I wasn't born in 2017, but I'm born on the 2nd of, uh, the 10th of December. So that was when Spring Day came out, or the teaser, I'm blanking now. Um, yeah, it's so pretty. Thank you so much. 
I'm really happy. The quality is gorgeous. I don't have room on my pin hoop. I need to get another pin hoop, probably from Honey Baby Leah, but, you know, when you're on a budget, you gotta wait. So, yeah, thank you, Bratuka Pins. Again, I'll link them down below. Absolutely stunning um, designs. Okay, so, I guess we should just get right into it. Um, I can also, okay, so I'll answer this question first. Someone said, how do you sort your binder, my binders and categorize? So, so far what I have is total disorganization, except for, I guess, the members. So since I sort of collect OT7, I mean, not technically, but when I pull them, I collect them. And as you saw in my recent haul, I actually got a lot of different members. So I sort by my biases first. And who I collect first. So I put Jimin first. Then I put some JK. And that that's all I have of JK. Oh my god. Okay. And then I put some uh, Jin. You're going to see some holes. I own these. Like her O. I own them. They're actually right here. I put them in these. And I kind of display them in my room. So yeah, I do, now they're not falling down because I was holding them, but yeah, I do own her O and her O Jin, her O Jin, Jimin and Jin. So, um, someone asked me what my favorite photo cards are. Well, what my favorite photo card is, I have to say her O, but like OT7 her O. I'm like obsessed with that design with the flowers and even like the clouds and anyway, stunning. I'm trying to collect OT7. Uh, yeah, so then I go Jin, because Jin became the second member that I started collecting. So I have Jin, and then I go leader to, uh, and then age, um, order of age. So Namjoon, Yoongi, I know, I know, this is sad. I know, I know. Don't worry, we got some more. Um, and then, <laughs> uh, we go, uh, yeah, order of age. So Hopi, I know it's sad. Tay, I know it's sad. And then I got OT7. So I have quite a few OT7 or like unit PCs as well. I put them here. Um, and then I went with this, I guess, because it was also part of, uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll do, I don't know. Interesting. Okay. Then I continue with some other photo cards from DVDs and uh albums oh i do have okay my last video i said i didn't have this ot7 i actually do so that means i'm only missing hobie which i'm gonna be trading for my second jimin because as you see i have two jimins um i also have two tays i think or no i traded all my tays okay i traded all my tays good okay yeah so i'm missing hobie um i got jungkook we're gonna put him away in here um so I can put, what am I going to, so Jin's going to have to move. Uh-oh. Okay. Um, see, these are the issues of like organizing. Uh, and then I have some lenticulars, which I think I'll transfer into the other binder. Then some more Japan DVD photo cards, some booklets, lights. See, there's no organization. I finally got this. I don't think I posted a video, but I traded with my friend because she biases Hobie and I bias Jimin and this costs like a hundred dollars. So I was like, no way. Like I cannot. So we traded. <laughs> I love her. Thank you, Amanda. Um, yeah, I pulled a Tay for school love affair. And then I have some of these. Oh, I can put the other one here, the OT7. Okay, interesting. Then I have in the soup. Then it goes into like more like, you know, ring PCs, concert PCs, which I'm going to have to fit one in there by Mancon. Just random stuff. I, th I tried to put this in order of date. So like the most recent was, well, Map of the Soul wasn't the most recent. It was Bang Bang Con, so I need to reorganize that, but we probably won't do it, because or else this video will last three hours. Um, yeah, so that's basically it. <laughs> that's basically it. So let's get into it. I guess, like, I'll start by 
these ones I'm not going to organize. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with these. Now I have... Whoops, this one's bent. That's my fault. It doesn't matter. I have these times like three. I have some hanging up that I ordered separately. And I got these by accident. There's a lot of stuff that I got by accident because it was just freebies with what I was actually trying to buy. Wait, I have the gin. Okay, brilliant. You know, sometimes I solve my own problems. I love that for me. Um, You know what? I know what we're going to start with. So my first page of my binder I'm deciding is going to be um, B. <laughs> So I didn't show an unboxing or anything, but I got the album finally. And I'm so happy. It's so pretty. Oh my gosh. So I think like all of this amounts to eight photo cards and then nine and then I can put it perfectly into one page and it's going to look stunting. I'm not going to do um, an unboxing of this because I'm sure everyone on the faces is, or on the faith that... I can't even speak. On the face of this earth, that is ARMY. Oh, don't scan that. I should scan that now. I just showed you this. Okay, be right back. I need to scan this so no one steals it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, my one thing is I don't know if I'm going to put these away. I think I'm going to leave them in the album. I displayed one. Um, To be honest, I don't know which one's which. The only one that I'm for sure is that one's Yoongi. That one's Namjoon. I need to watch, like, the videos where they explain, because I didn't watch... Oh, yeah, that's where I would know. Okay, yeah, because I didn't watch them because I got my album so late, so I'm really behind on that. So I'll watch that, and then I'll be able to know which one's which. So, so far, we'll just do these. So I'm going to do it in order of age. Um, or we'll, we'll go OT7 to OT7. Okay, so OT7, then leader to age. So we'll start by putting that there, and then this here. Okay. Let's answer another question. So what hair color do you think looks best on each member? Um, I didn't write who asked which question, but thank you to everyone who asked questions. Honestly, like I wasn't getting any responses at first. I was like, oh no, nobody cares. But yeah. So for me personally, best is a uh, natural hair color. For sure. Um, should I have them sitting up like this? Yeah, I'll put them like this so that the heads are all up. Okay. Um, yeah, natural hair, hair color on each of them. But if we're going to start thinking about, like, which wacky color afterwards, I would say... I didn't even realize it was leaking. Yo, these photo cards are so cool. Um, I love how they all wrote B in their own writing on the back. Stunning. Um, yeah. What was I saying? This is my train of thought. Oh, yeah. So then if we're thinking, like, wacky colors, well, then I would say... Okay, let's go member by member. This is... See, I can't multitask. I'm trying to put away and answer questions I can't. Uh, Namjoon. I'm actually going to put away a photo card of my favorite color on him. This is going to maybe come to a surprise to people, but I really like the duo blue and blonde, like the blonde undercut with like the blue gray top. That's my favorite Namjoon look or just blue in general. I think it's just stunning on him. Um, JK, <sighs> bruv, do I even have to like with what happened this weekend? Blonde JK, 1 million percent. Oh my god, it looks so good on him. Like, I love Cherry Koo, but like, damn. Damn, 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 damn. It looks so good. So, Blonde JK. So, Blonde JK, Blue Nam June, Hobie, I have to say, I really like, because he has his natural brown, I really like the jet black from Dynamite with like the little swoopy. That's like stunning. I think we all know we were thirsting over it, like on the internet all together as a fandom. Um, Jimin, oh, Jimin's hard. I have to say, probably pink. Yeah, because, like, Kitty Gang, pink Jimin, but also, like, Kitty Gang, blonde Jimin. Oh, my God, I don't know. I'm going to say pink because I said blonde Koo, so, like, there you go. So, pink Jimin, uh, Yoongi, mint, mint, min Yoongi, even though it was chalk, we don't care, we don't listen to that negativity. 
<laughs> I really want to see another mint Minuki who was really cute or like an interesting color because I feel like yeah lately he's done a lot of gray a lot of blonde and he did um well natural now and dark colors so I'd like to see another color on Minuki um Tay what do I like I guess I'm not the red Tay was really you know what you know what have been what would have been sick like singularity performed in like the full feathered gown with the red hair that would have been absolutely stunning and gin purple gin i just have something for like him dyeing his own hair like that's hot so yeah and that looks really pretty on the opposite side all the bees yay i'm happy stunning okay so let's just go one by one now oh uh, okay I'm selling this, by the way. Um, I'm going to post it on my Instagram, which is linked below, because I'm a dum-dum, and I pulled him. I literally pulled this from the album. I bought the album, I pulled it, and then I freaking bought it on Mercari. I don't know which came first, the chicken or the egg. <sighs> Anyways. So, yeah. This is my pull. <laughs> I'm so angry. Um, oh, crap. I'm going to have to reorganize this, because now I completed the her set. I completed Jungkook her. Oh my god. I'm so happy. So this I'm going to sell. <laughs> um, I have another one that I was going to sell, but I already sold it to a friend. The quality was pretty good. I'm really happy with everything that came in. Okay, I have to figure out how to do this. Um, Okay, so tier I haven't finished yet. So tier we'll put there and then we'll move stuff down. Okay, um, someone had bought sleeves that actually, so I also have her O Jungkook. Someone had bought sleeves that actually, like, house eight. House. Why did I say it like that? So I don't know how it is, but, no, I think, yeah, yeah, so they go like this. So it's one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And I think that's absolutely stunning. And I need to find some because I'm so sick of this, like, nine slot sleeve. It's so frustrating. Like, it's so impractical. Okay, so I need to figure out what to put there. So I need another page for my JK. Yeah, because I almost finished. I didn't finish Mott's yet. I only have two. I have this one? Oh yeah, I traded this one. This is why I don't trade because I forget. <laughs> when I buy, I usually remember that I bought something, but when I trade, I just blank. Okay, so what we'll do is... Okay, so next we have Persona. Okay, I know what I'm gonna do. We're gonna keep Love Yourself for now together, so I'm gonna take off Persona, um, Moth's Persona. I'm gonna take out my answers. Okay, I'm gonna answer another question. BTS songs you have an emotional connection to. Spring Day. Anything that has to do with friendship, like, it gets me. It gets me hard. Like, that sounded... Sorry, I apologize. <laughs> like, it gets to me a lot, is what I was trying to say. Uh, Spring Day... Uh, two, three, I have to say as well. Um, I have to say my time as well. God, I'm blanking. Moving on is like, <sighs> moving on is really emotional for me as well. I think like, they address issues like that so brilliantly. God, stand BTS. <laughs> Imagine you're here and you don't stand BTS. Hello, haters. Just kidding. Um, yeah. Moving on. Two, three. Those have really... Those really get to me. Like, those can... Oh, I'm such an idiot. One of the songs that make me, like, cry the most is Whalian. Hello. Whalian is, like, so emotional. Okay. Um, your favorite color. Pink and yellow. And that actually goes hand in hand with which is my favorite BT21 characters. Um, it's funny because it's my biases. And they both chose my favorite color, so I'm happy. So, 
um, Chimmy and Cookie. Um, okay, what's next? Minyungi. Again. Oh yeah, that's the one I sold. So as you can see, I'm a dumbass. And I bought it even though I pulled it. Or I already traded it. No, I traded it, yeah. Yep, I traded it and then I bought it. Because I'm what? Intelligent. Okay. I'm going to put it solely in here like this. Actually, that doesn't feel good. Yeah, I mean, like putting it in that. Okay, I'll put it with this one for sales. So I'll be sending this out to you soon. To the person I sold it to. Okay, so I obviously bought some more Yunki. And I'm so happy because I pulled this one. So now I can put those together. Maybe I'll put, yeah, I'll put you down here because you're a little darker and this one still has like the bluey colors. So there isn't much organization when it comes to members because I don't have a lot of each. More Namjoon. I got so much Namjoon. Okay, we're going to move you down to the bottom. Can y'all see what's happening? Yeah, okay. Okay, next. Uh... <laughs> the way I wrote it exactly how she asked the question. Brie asked me a question and she... Sorry, I got confused. Um, yeah, she asked me a question. How the fuck do you start collecting and trading cards? Again, I don't know much. Like, for me, I did a lot of mistakes. I bought a lot off eBay in the beginning, um, which was not a good idea. Uh, I overpaid. And then I started buying off Mercari. And Mercari has things for really cheap, but shipping is so bad. So like my friend Heaven, hi Heaven, you're mentioned in every single one of my videos. I'm gonna have to start paying you. <laughs> and then, um, yeah, so Heaven uh, told me about Nokio. I'm gonna do a haul maybe like, I don't know, in a few months and I'll let you know, but definitely like eBay's overpriced. I recommend buying off of uh, friends and sellers on Instagram and Twitter. It's just concerning sometimes. I love this hobby. I have to post on my Instagram and I'm going to post with this because I'm doing like an OT7. Uh, I have to post one of each member. Well, I don't have to. I want to. Um, and then I can end with an OT7B. Duh. So I think I'm going to post about this hobby because it's absolutely adorable. Um, so yeah. I would recommend buying off of sites like Nokio and stuff that have like VPN, I guess, for Japanese buyers because they sell them for so cheap. Um, yeah, that's my recommendation. If I have this gin, I'm going to cry. Oh, thank God. Okay, so yay! I didn't even realize I finished my... Um, so I have all Mott's gin. Oh, I'm so proud. Yay. I'm so happy. Gin is like another member that I really need to finish the sets. Okay, sorry. I'm trying to make things over. Okay. I'll try putting those there. Okay, good. I'm really happy. So I finished gin. Yay. So cute. I think out of all of them, my favorite one is the Daddy Jin. I like that the threes both have that. These are both black. These both have, like, I guess, collars. And then these both have the straight. Did he do that on purpose? Anyway. Okay, and then this Jimin is so stunning. Shit, I was ask answering a question. Um, Yeah, so I'm going to link down below uh, my friends. I'm going to link Heaven's Instagram because she is, she has like so much advice on her Instagram. It's like amazing. I highly recommend you guys go follow her. She constantly posts stories about like how to buy, what's, how to be smart while buying. And it's just, yeah, it's really good. Uh, so shout out to Heaven. I'll also post Jane uh, down below because her YouTube channel is like, she buys so much. Oh my God. She's like one of the top collectors, I think on YouTube, if not the top. Um, that I know of anyway. So her too, I'm going to link her below. And then she has so much advice on her YouTube. Uh, but coming from me, pff, 
I wouldn't say I have the best advice. <laughs> I think I have to start a new Jimin. How many photo cards are in here? Okay. Because so I want to put, unless I have too many Jimins. Just kidding. You can never have too many Jimins. Um, okay. What we're going to do is we're going to put you over here. Because you kind of have tier vibes. Um, we're going to put you here. And then, so I have both Samsung Jimins. Well, the old ones. Because I think now there's new ones with the ring and proposing. But they're earbuds. Um, yeah. So, I hope that answers your question. If you have any other questions, just DM me on Twitter. Because, <laughs> like, that was really unclear, to be honest, how I was, like, talking about it. Um, okay, so, oh my god, my Namjoon page just filled up. I went from four photo cards to, like, so many. I'm happy, and there might be more, actually. Okay, this one I can't. Those. I'm going to put my JK and my, the ones I need to sell. Actually, I might sell these or give them as freebies. Okay. Uh, next. Okay. Now I want to make sure that I have all like regular photo cards out of the way. Cause these are going to be a little more complicated. Okay. Yeah, I think we're good. Okay. So this I have, I, by far, I do not collect this set at all. But I do have a few. So I'll be able to put Namjoon with them. Um, okay, so that, that, I'm going to try and separate these I bought because Jin is so stunning in them. I already said it, but I'm re-saying it. Okay, next question. Uh, a K-pop group you may be interested in getting into. <sighs> like, I really don't want to get hate for this, I really do apologize, but I'm not getting into any other K-pop groups. Will I, like, like things on Twitter and follow some? Yes, but, like, I'm not, like, buying, like, this for any other K-pop group. Um, for me to buy and spend, I, like, really need to make an emotional connection, and like I've already said, like, when I went, when I got into BTS, I was, like, in a really bad state of mind, and they really, like, helped me out of it. Like, they really saved me, like, in a way that, I, <laughs> you know, it doesn't happen often in life, so I really am appreciative of that, and, like, so, yeah, I don't think I'm going to be getting into, like, more K-pop groups. I do listen, like, casually to some groups, um, but, yeah, BTS is, like, my ult and probably going to be the only one and the last one. Uh, I never really fangirled over things. I know I, I say this a lot, but I've never really fangirled over things because I do have a trouble committing to anything like jobs, like relationships, friendships. I've, and BTS has helped me, um, actually like overcome a lot of that, which I really appreciate. And, uh, BTS is definitely one of the first things I committed to. Other than I mentioned on Twitter that I really liked the Hunger Games before. And some people uh, were kind of negative about me being a fan of it. So that had turned me off of being a fan of things for a little while. But BTS really just, they opened my heart, man. Sorry, this was about other K-pop groups and I started to talk about BTS. Um, I will say, though. Uh, actually, I do, okay, I have to say I do listen to everything. I do listen to every Everglow song. Like, I really like Everglow. And I bought one of their albums, but I probably won't be spending or collecting on them anymore. Um, but I do really like Everglow. Uh, twice, I like a few of their songs, obviously. And, like, I love it. The thing is, is, like, I have a really good memory. So I know most of each group's members' names. But I just, yeah, I don't, like, intensively, like, stan anything. But I do know a lot about a lot of different groups, especially just being on Twitter. Like, a lot of my friends are multis, and, like, they post about them. I'm like, okay, who's that? And then I get to know it, because I like being in the loop with things. But, yeah, um, I do love some of Monster X. Like, I love, oh my god, Stray Kids, some of their songs slap so hard, and they're so cute. Um, it's also hard sometimes to, like, stan a group, and then they do something super problematic. Ooh, okay. Is this okay that's my okay let's get to bang bang con we're fast forwarding to bang bang con um i guess i'll just have to start a new one because obviously these are filled in okay so let's get a new one 
Did I buy some more? I did. Fantastic. Okay, next. Um, what do you do with photo cards? Ooh, okay. Um, well, I have my Instagram that I have down below. Mostly they just sit in here, let's be real. I also wish I had like a different size. I think the eight ones fit these actually. So I really need to look into getting those because this is ridiculous. Like they kind of just float and it looks cute, I guess, but it could look cuter. You know what I mean? Like it's really clean. I saw my friend Cynthia. I'll link her Instagram <laughs> down below. I'm just going to be, this is promo for everyone. Um, and she also has a YouTube channel. Duh. Okay. I'll also link her down below, but she bought them and it's so stunning with these, like the four, four she collected, like, cause usually it's set of eight. So she collected all of Tay and it looks so pretty. So goals. Um, yeah. Uh, so what do you do with photo cards? I have an Instagram of my own, which I always link down below and I just take aesthetic. I think they're aesthetic photos of them. And I just like collecting, like before this, I have, maybe I'll give you guys a flip through of my Pokemon binder. <laughs> I have Pokemon cards, Yu-Gi-Oh cards, like it's just something I do. Okay, I don't know why I bought this. Well, okay, let's be real. I know why I bought this. <laughs> oh, do I have no more space? Oh, shite. Okay, I'm going to move the OT7 over there and then I have to take out Jin and he's going somewhere else. Oh, I can put him over there. Okay. See, this is the mess. Like, I wouldn't be able to properly organize my binder on camera because it's too chaotic. Like, I change ideas every two seconds. Right now, I'm just trying to put things away so they're not sitting in a box. Um, Yeah, I don't like this angle as much as I like this one over here. This was a lot better. You guys got to see more. Okay. Um, yeah, so I have an Instagram where I take pictures. I used to put them behind in my phone case, but I find during COVID, let me know if anyone else got this, but like my phone has been getting so hot that like, I'm afraid it'll melt my photo card. So I'm not doing that anymore. Oh no. Okay. I'll add another one. I thought it would... I'm scared I didn't buy enough of these plastics now. I really, like, I should have bought more. We'll see. We'll see how much, uh, okay. Close that. I almost hit my arm. Okay, so I'll put Jin with <laughs> Namjin page. Love that for me. I would love to get all of Namjins like these. I bought another one and then it, like, they canceled the order. Um another one what do you do with photo cards i hope i'm answering these questions because like i said i'm a little overwhelmed so if i'm like all over the place and i don't answer properly i really do apologize i was testing this because i just don't usually know what to say when i'm putting things away and i already spoke about all the photo cards during my unboxing why is nam june chilling there can I put him over? I'm gonna put him over here. That's weird. I think I just put him there randomly because I hadn't had a place for him. Just for now. Because I know that this is filled up. Okay, that was weird. Um, yeah, okay. So do you want to start journaling? Listen. I start journaling. Look at this. I always start journaling. And then I give up immediately. This is from 2018. And then it turned into 2020. <laughs> it's like such a mess. Like, you see what I mean? I just am not good at journaling. I think like if I would journal, I shouldn't do like something that I have to commit to every day. Because it's not going to happen. I would have to do like, I like when people do spreads for, let's say you watch a concert and then you want to like, Share your memories or your feelings or your thoughts. Kind of like a diary um, journal. That would be chill. I have a lot of diaries. Oh my god, this is technically a diary. It has some diary things in it. Because um, I do find like writing out my thoughts is good. Sorry if my voice is so raspy. I guess I'm not used to talking this much. But yeah. Okay, this I'm going to put 
this I'm going to take out there because I don't even know why it's there. And then I could put Jimin's VT up here. I'm still missing Jimin's, but I might not get it to be honest. I don't want to support them. But I have to say, their visuals are stunning. So here, I got these by accident, I think. I don't know. I don't know what my thought process is when I'm buying. Just do it. <laughs> As Shia LaBeouf would say, just do it. Okay, um, good. Okay, I think I'm gonna, I think I'm done with this binder for now. Yeah, I'm gonna put everything else in the other binder. So, that was my first binder. This is actually going, oh no, I'm not done with this binder. I have all my one stuff. I'm such a dumb dumb. Okay. I'll organize them into sheets and then I'll put them in. Okay. Oh, let's get my sheets. Next question. Um, favorite place you love going? This is interesting because this is so like open. Like I could say anything. I'm going to say all you can eat sushi. <laughs> I love all you can eat sushi and I love nature walks. Yeah, definitely. So yeah, I got the um one concert merch. Absolutely stunning. So I love these. They're like so pretty. I'm sorry, I haven't been good at unboxing things lately. I have this that I'm gonna probably put it in. So I can put boom boom and then the last one. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, let's do that first. Um, this is day one, I think, because the second day was the 11th. Yeah, okay. So this I'll put in here. Like this. There you go. 11. And then like this. Ooh, this is loose. I have to watch out. You know what I'm going to do? I have tape. I kind of want to tape it just to make sure it doesn't. Okay, I'll tape it later. Okay, and then I have also, these are so pretty. The quality is like, first of all, I thought it was a random pull, so I didn't know I was getting OT7. So I was so shocked when I got all seven. These are so pretty. I'm like such a loser. I'm going to leave them in these plastics too. I want them to be extra protected. <laughs> Um, yeah. So, all you can eat sushi and nature walks. Uh, do you have any pets? Yes, I have Luna, my kitty. She is on the bed behind me. I love her so much. She finds me annoying, but she loves me. I know she does. She's also my alarm in the morning. <laughs> yep. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, is there a game that you love playing? Okay, lately... I've been so obsessed. These look so pretty. I've been so obsessed with Stardew Valley. Like, I play that all the time. If y'all are my friends in real life or, like, online and want to add me on Steam, please let me know and we can be Steam friends. DM me on Twitter. Um, I'm leaving my Twitter down below. So, yeah. DM me on Twitter if you want to be Steam friends. Um... Yeah, so Stardew Valley, I'm like, I've been obsessed with lately. Okay, finish my first page of questions. On to the next. Uh, opinion on Minecraft. <laughs> I don't know why this made me laugh. Um, I don't know. I don't really have an opinion on Minecraft. I feel like I don't want to get hate or anything. I feel like, no, that's, that's having an opinion. I can't say anything. Because if I say something, it's me having an opinion. Um, I was gonna say, I find some Minecraft people are a little intense about it, so I don't, I'm like so open to everyone's likes and stuff, so if it makes you happy, then I'm happy. Shite, I knew it, I didn't buy enough for, I'm such a dumbass. The one thing I needed, I didn't get enough of. I'm so angry. I was sure I bought more. I was sure I bought enough. I'm just gonna go through these quickly. Oh no. I guess I'm gonna just have to order online. Why did I order so many of these when I literally have 40? I'm such a dumb dumb. I did not calculate. 
Okay, well now I don't know where to put all of these. All my one cards that have been chilling in here. Okay, you know what? Maybe I'll just do a double back. Let's go through my binder and let's maybe do a double back. Plus I have all of these as well. Ugh, I have so much. Well, these I can put away actually because these I left spaces open. It's just my one cards. Maybe, I don't know. It's hard to order online because like someone asked me, actually one of the questions is where do you buy your sleeves? There's this little um, shop in my near my parents' house and they sell them like individually and it's pretty cheap. I feel like it's like three, it's like three or five for one dollar. So it comes out to way cheaper than buying them online. Or am I stupid? I don't know. Um, but yeah, so oh, that's so frustrating that I didn't buy enough. Classic. Classic. And I won't be going home for a long ass time because of the freaking pandemic. Okay, I'm going to put these away as well. Ooh, yeah, they're falling out. I have to watch out. Definitely going to want to tape those. I'll put them here. Oh, I also have some other stuff. That okay, so the video is not done. It's just my brain cells are. I should put them here. Ah, see. Okay. Um. Yeah. So opinions on Minecraft? No opinion. <laughs> I mean, I like open world and building. It's just I guess I just don't really like like the shape of the characters and stuff so that's that <laughs> um how long have you been in army it's i'm going on like three years i'm i'm like at almost two years and a half i'm so happy i'm so happy to be here hi friends um yeah i got into them i've already told my origin story my origin story my like how i got into them like a bajillion times okay i really need to go get tape because this is like i'm scared Okay, I can't find regular tape, but I found some washi tape, so. Oh, I'm such a dumbass. It was right down there. But washi tape Loki would look prettier. I mean, high key would look prettier. What the hell? I don't know how to rip tape open. I, like, managed to rip a small... Um, yeah, what was I answering? How long have you been in army? Almost two years and a half. Um, thoughts on our <laughs> Queen Spring Day! Yes, um, I love it. <laughs> it's my favorite BTS song. I just wish she was OT7. Um, I'm so happy that the performances are OT7, though. That makes me happy. Yes, this is messy. Don't judge me, okay? I just, like, don't want them falling out. There you go. Well, <laughs> actually, that kind of looks cute, I have to say. It's just because these three parts are like this one's gonna be hard to tape down actually because it's too i'm gonna have to make sure okay let's do that one first and we'll use this tape i have to push it down like this and then go like this that looks so ugly <laughs> i hope everyone's having a blast watching me struggle Heaven got me this tape. She knows me so well. I love the Nightmare Before Christmas. Um, this looks ugly. Okay. Um, yeah, I love Spring Day. She's like my alt. Um, okay. Uh, is there a song that you listen to and just think of this has top bias vibes? Okay, when I read this question, like I knew immediately, Home has Jimin vibes. Damn, his freaking vocals in that? Are we kidding right now? I'm obsessed. I'm seriously obsessed. Love that song. Um, yeah, that is like ultimate Jimin vibes. I think, I don't know. It's just how he like curls his voice. If that's the right word. I don't know. Okay, I'm really excited <laughs> to put Jimin's away. Watch me having bought like some that I already have. I don't want to fuck this up. Okay. One eight. Ah, okay. I don't have it. <laughs> I was so nervous buying these. I was so scared that I bought like doubles. <laughs> it's so hard to track these, but obviously, 
Okay, I'm just missing one more. Okay, cool, cool, cool. <laughs> Yay! So I am missing one. Okay, I'll make sure to look into that. Oh my god! <laughs> uh, okay, so I finally finished <laughs> four of eight. <laughs> I'm missing one more. Okay, so I'm missing only that one. <laughs> I had actually given up collecting OT7 for this, and then suddenly I saw these for good prices, and I was like, listen, I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna shoot my shot. <laughs> cool. Okay, um, next question. Uh, a song you would recommend to BTS or your bias? Interesting. I feel like they probably know the song, but Blood by the Middle East is, like, so stunning. I freaking love that song, man. Also, I would recommend <laughs> BTS Dance to Body. Let's go. I want to see a dance cover of any Megan Thee Stallion song ever. <laughs> That's what I would recommend. That'd be freaking awesome. Um, okay, yeah. <laughs> uh... Rex on how to start a binder and what sleeves. Okay, so like I said, for me personally, I'd like the eight slot sleeve. Um, but this really looks stunning. I have to say this is probably my fave page because it's so like, <sighs> it's satisfying. Like there's enough slots for every photo card and it looks good. Everything's like cohesive. It's aesthetically pleasing. Um, these aren't practical for album PC since there's usually four versions. So I guess it's good like in the long run if you collect a lot, but ideally I would have the eight slot sleeves, eight slot sleeves, eight slot sleeves. Sorry, I was trying to say it 10 times fast. Um, I really, I'm shooketh. I just spoke for so long and <laughs> my phone stopped recording. Um, I don't even know what I, what I said. Oh, shite. Okay, well. I think I explained a little bit how I like to organize um, and how to start a binder. Okay, yeah, so I was just giving, like, a little bit of advice to, like, try not to be peer pressured. So if something makes you uncomfy or something makes you feel like um, you have to buy something and that's not, like, good for you financially or just mentally or emotionally, uh, don't feel like you need to. Uh, personally, I only buy what I want. Um, I, I used to be a little, uh, peer pressured and then I just kind of took a step back and I realized what makes me comfiest and what makes me happiest. And once I like kind of got that down, I realized that this is what, I mean, like I collect a lot, like I collect stones, I collect Pokemon cards, I collect plants, I collect BTS. So I do collect a lot. Um, that's just a hobby of mine, but if collecting puts you in a space that's like not comfy, I recommend like yeah just stepping back like if this video makes you uncomfortable i truly apologize like this is just something that i like to do and it's something that i worked on and that i spent money on and i want to share because i did that because i guess like what do i like doing with my photo cards i like posting them on instagram and i like sharing my collection with like other armies and stuff uh, comparing and contrasting to others is also toxic. Don't feel like you need to do that because that could also lead you to like maybe a headspace or like, yeah, an uncomfy headspace, which you don't want either. Um, yeah, so buy what you want. Make sure you want it. Like, don't feel like you need to get it. Templates sometimes make you feel like you need to get something. Don't do templates. Like, I don't do templates unless it's album PCs because album PCs are more affordable but don't do templates if they make you um feel like you need something rather than you just buying something because you want something that's my little advice for uh, that um i think that's all i said oh, you know that meme of jk saying like oh, i i had i had something amazing to say or whatever i did say like some really good things so i tried to like wrap up what i said quickly because actually because my phone, I need to, that's another thing. I collect, like, BTS photos on my phone. And I have no more space on my phone. So, filming videos, yeah, it sucks. Like, I have to delete a bunch of stuff before filming. I need to fix that issue as well. Um, okay. So, I know I have a JK. So, I'm going to put this here. Okay. 
there you go beautiful okay so my photos like this they go in the other binder actually this one I'll also put in the other binder oh shit I forgot about all of these okay so these will all go in here those will go in the other one okay uh what was my next question uh what would a date with your alt look like oh god I don't know. I never thought about it. <laughs> if I'm being honest. Um, on dates, I usually like going for food and walking. Like, spending time with someone and just speaking, like, talking to the person and getting to know them. That's really important to me. So, like, uh, like dinner and a walk or something. Or, like, an activity where if you go to, like, an amusement park, you can kind of still interact that too is really important to me so i would say those do these fit in here stunning okay what am i doing um what's something people would be surprised to know you like i don't know i don't like anything that's like too out there oh i forgot i have stickers in there i'm gonna have to put them in the sticker thing with these official stickers. I didn't know they were official. I don't know what to do with them. <laughs> um, I guess horror movies? Yeah, like I'm a huge fan of horror movies. So, I don't know if that's shocking news or not. <laughs> this just in, Sabrina likes horror and gore. Uh, yeah, I've watched a lot of messed up movies that I regret sometimes. And I'm like... Why is that? Why did I watch that? <laughs> now I have to live with that. <laughs> so, yeah. Okay, I'm going to take another. So, I guess horror movies would be the most surprising. Uh, which BTS unit would you like to see collab on a song? Hello, Mini Mini, Yunmin. Hello, Tony Montana, Studio Virgin. <laughs> um, yeah, I definitely want to see more Yoongi and... Uh, Jimin, and I think it's coming. I think it's gonna come, so I'm excited about that. Okay, I'm gonna put these together, even though they don't. Wait, do they go together? No, this is. I'm really bad at these. Like I said, like I don't know what goes where, and like, anyway. But I really like this look. Um, what was I saying? Oh, this is my issue. I get, like, so lost in my thoughts. Uh, yeah, Yunmin unit. Uh, fave BTS era. I'm gonna say you never walk alone. And HYYH era. I, like, change a lot, but, like, lately it's been HYYH. I wanna put my two units together. Oh, so I... Okay, never mind. This needs to go back here. Um, yeah, definitely HYYH era, and You Never Walk Alone, like, the BU, damn, I still need to read the notes, I have uh, book one and two, yeah, I need to do a lot of things, um, I kind of want to put these together now, it's Break the Silence and Bring the Soul, but I want to put them together, And it looks pretty like that. Yeah, it does. Okay, good. Um, okay, which member are you most similar to? Okay, <laughs> how's about which member I'm not similar to? Okay, that sounded weird. What I mean is that I'm not... I wouldn't say I'm like, oh my god, I'm so much like Jimin or like I'm so much like this person. I have like similar traits to a, a few of them and then others I just like really <laughs> don't. Um, like I'd say I'm, I'm a lot like Jin when it comes to like social, I'm very good at like ice breaking. I'm very sociable. I'm really out there, but I also like really like my alone time. Um, and I like playing my video games and not talking to a lot of people sometimes, but I am very sociable. So that I would say for Jin, uh, RM will like plants and like nature walks and all of that. That's definitely what I have in common with, uh, Namjoon. Uh, Yungi and Tay, I really don't have a lot in common with. Tay, maybe I like painting. I just recently started painting and crafting. So maybe that? 
I think, yeah. I think, yeah, with Tay, maybe that. Yungi, I really don't have a lot in common with Yungi, but I feel like in person, I feel like we would get along a lot, me and Yungi. Um, actually, my best friends really like Yungi. Um and we get along so well <laughs> so and it's funny because at first like I feel like sometimes we'd have some miscommunications and I feel like yeah now we've just like I feel like we're able to understand each other on like a really deep level and yeah I'm really appreciative of that friendship um and then Jimin like well I guess I kind of like have that like I do I'm really good at like doing the cutesy thing like when I'm playing Among Us that's another game I like playing a lot with my friends. <laughs> when I play Among Us, I'm really good at like being like innocent and like, oh, but like having like kind of that duality of like I'm a sneaky little Slytherin, but I'm also like, I can be like that cute little innocent one as well. Um, Hobie, I think people see me the most as Hobie. Definitely. Like I have to say, yeah. I come, like a lot of people are like, oh, you give off Hobie vibes. And it's, like, we're both Aquarius and, like, we're both so, like, out there and, like, but we're also very observant. And sometimes you can see us standing to the side and watching rather than, but we can also be, like, the center of attention, like, really quick. So we kind of have, like, that switch, like, that turns on and off right away. Um, all of these observations are from their bang time bombs and stuff. I don't know these boys personally, obviously, and I don't want people to think that I think that. I just... These are observations that I get from, like, Bangtan Bombs or, like, from BTS or whatever. Um, and then finally, Jungkook. Um, I don't have much in common with Jungkook, actually. Just that. <laughs> I guess sometimes, like, we go a little intense. Like, one of the questions is, what are my 2021 goals? I get kind of intense with my goals sometimes. Like, when I really want to put my mind to something. Um... I just go for it a little too intensely, but usually I'm good at controlling myself. Like, I'm usually healthy about it, but sometimes I can get down on myself a little bit if I don't think I achieved it. I also started crafting and needle felting recently, and a lot of people are like, oh my god, that's so cute, that's so good, and I always, like, get down on myself because I don't think it's at the level I want it to be. I know practice and stuff will make it perfect, but I still get a little frustrated with that kind of stuff. I know I need to be less of a perfectionist. Like, I'm by far not an artist. Like, really not me, but, like, I do like creating things. And then when it's not up to par with what I want it to be, I do get a little sad slash frustrated. Should I put the, I'll put the HYYH in the other one, because this binder is about to blow. Do you see this? It's about to blow. Look at that. Holy moly. Yo, thank you for coming on this journey with me. I know this is going to be another long video. Next video, I want to do like a Twitter decides my day or something. Where did I take this one? And that one's going to be way shorter. I like doing short videos, but I also just... I'm lazy sometimes, so I like these unedited, just, like, posted videos as well. Um, yeah. So, what was I answering? Which my- oh, yeah, so JK. Yeah, so that's- so I don't think I'm, like, particular. I guess, like, if you have to compare me to one, it would probably be Jin or Hobie. I feel like people say Nam June, but, like, I don't like putting myself on the level of Namjoon. He's like so up there. He's so... This isn't going to fit. This isn't going to fit. Mother trucker. Okay, let me go get... These are so gross. I'm so angry that I have to use these. These are like old from like school and stuff. So the quality is not the best. And some of them have like a weird like blurry texture to it. I don't know. I'm not happy. But... Like I said, this is, like, I guess just putting away. I'm going to reorganize, and then I can do, like, a binder flip through. Although y'all probably saw most of it right now. Um, yeah. What was I saying? I don't know. I never know what I'm saying. I was talking about...
which member okay yeah so i think most people would say hope when i post a picture of myself like on twitter i'm like you know that trend like which one do i do i remind you of the most and then i usually i usually get hopey or namjoon um oh yeah and i don't want to put myself on the same level as namjoon this isn't official but it's really cute so it's going in here <laughs> this is me like panicking and just because i don't have a lot of time left on my thing okay so i'm gonna put this here even though i own this this one I'm going to have to give away as a freebie or sell it, maybe. Yeah, so I have quite a few things to sell. I'm debating selling my uh, Bang Bang Con. Um, premium photo of Jimin. I got the one one. I feel like I don't know where to put them. Like, my premium photos. And, like, I'm not... I, start, I collected them out of pressure, I guess, those ones. But also because they look so good on them. <laughs> so yeah, I'm definitely going to sell a couple. Well, one of them. Maybe JK2, actually. Just keep my Mox 1. Whoops, I put it upside down because I'm brilliant. Um, Yeah. Okay, next question. Do I have any more questions? If you could go anywhere in the world once COVID is over, where would you go? I really want to go to Italy. I want to visit where my grandparents were born. Um, yeah, more and more. I really want to go to Korea and Japan as well, but I think first things first, I want to go to Italy with my mom. And I want her to, like, educate me on, like, where I'm from and stuff. Well, I'm not from there, but, like, my grandparents are. My mom was born here, so I'm second gen Italian. And I'm half French too, because I'm Quebecois. Um, sorry, I meant, when I said Quebecois, I said, like, that's, I'm a Quebecer, like French Canadian. Um, okay, is there any other group that you want to get into? I already answered that. What is your favorite photo card? Okay, my favorite, or no. What's a photo card that means a lot to you? Okay, we'll end on that. Because I think I finished. This is just a VT. Oh no, I have these that I need to put away. My Christmas ones. I don't know if they're going to fit in the three. It's not going to fit in here. I don't think it's going to fit in the three. They're too big. Oh, they don't even fit lengthwise. Okay, so I'll just put them in the I'm gonna take a bunch of these. Okay, so let's hurry up. Let's go. Sorry that this was kind of like, I don't know. I guess we're just hanging out. If you came and watched all of this, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Hee hee, tee hee. And yeah, like I said, for collecting and stuff, don't do anything you don't wanna do. Okay, seriously. I'm gonna be a mom right now. Only collect if you want to. Do not feel peer pressured. If watching videos like this makes you feel peer, uh, peer why am I saying peer pressured? Peer pressured, please do not. Collect what you want, not what you think you need. Don't make anyone feel make you feel like you need something. Do what you want. Um, this I want to display, but I guess I'll put it in here. I think I answered everyone's questions. Again, thank you so much for people answering questions, uh, asking me questions. And the people that did ask me questions, because it seems like there was a lot of questions, right? But a lot of people just asked me like 10 questions. I really do appreciate it. Sorry, I wasn't doing it off camera. I just put that away. I put my Christmas ones in there as well. These are kind of random stuff, I guess. Um, Yeah, thank you to everyone who asked me questions. I really do appreciate it. I now have a random pen. Um, and we'll end on the photo card that I love the most. So I'm going to say that the photo card that means the most to me is... I wonder if y'all can guess it. Pause and guess. Uh-oh, I just passed all my Jimin photo cards. Everyone must be like, what is the photo card? And I shall reveal it. It is Jin. Her L. And you want to know why? Because it's the first photo card I pulled. And now look at me. I'm here. And I'm so grateful. And I absolutely love BTS. And yeah, 
So I pulled this one and I'll never forget the sigh of frustration because it wasn't Jimin. <laughs> I had been standing BTS for two months. I was like, oh, oh no, I didn't get Jimin. And then I kept pulling Jin. I was like, what is happening? Like, and then I started collecting him. And then the rest is history. Or the rest is this. <laughs> so yeah, that Jin Her L, he looks so cute and tiny with his little cheekies. And I love the pink background. Pink is my favorite color. So yeah, that's my favorite photo card. Um, thank you for coming on this journey with me. I mean, we're not done because I still have <laughs> All of these to do i'm gonna buy some plastics eventually online um for now these will stay up here but yeah i really do appreciate y'all coming on this journey with me i'll say a little goodbye turn it around like this yeah so oh my god don't look at my room it's such a bad <laughs> but yeah so yeah that's how i like film if y'all were wondering that's my little desk so thank you for coming on this journey with me. Um, I'm so excited to do more stuff. I want to try new things on this channel as well. Um, and just be more creative. And I think that's some of my goals for 2021 too. Just like try and express myself more and be more open to expressing myself. So yeah, thank you for watching. And I hope I answered everyone's questions. I hope I answered everyone's questions as best as I could. My camera keeps cutting because I have no more space on my phone. I need to clean that up. That will be another goal for... Yeah. That will be a goal for January. Clean up my phone. 80,000 photos. I do not need all of that. So, my lips are dry. I have no makeup on. I'm just chilling in a sweater. Like, okay. <laughs> That's it, I guess. So, bye. <laughs>